Bring off three seconds. One, two, three, firing. Why did you omit the one? I maintain, of course, what I wrote. She said that, and I'm completely sure about that. There's no question about that. And of course, in a way, it's, it is so coherent. Uh, it's obvious. Uh, I mean, m most of you mustn't be surprised by what she said. By calling the last government hopeless, by praising the present government, quite clearly she has ventured beyond the accepted parameters of uh, the royal family. And I think that's a dangerous step for her to have taken. Not so much from her point of view, but certainly if you're looking to the future, uh, and the future, of course, is her son, who will one day, God willing, become uh, the king. She can't live with the press, as she tirelessly points out, but at the same time, she cannot live without the press, as is patently obvious by the way she has been cavorting herself from the south of France. I mean, she's been in this business for 16 years now, I and mean, she knows full well that if she appears in a swimsuit, the world's paparazzi are going to be on the beach taking photographs, and yet she still does it. So I don't think even a princess can have her cake and eat it. In Algérie, there are people who are massacred. There are wars everywhere in the world. And when we talk about a princess, it's gentil, but I think there are two or three hundred years of retard. I think it's a very beautiful woman et qu'elle euh, est un petit peu attaquée en Angleterre et qu'elle dev qu devrait être aussi aimée en Angleterre qu'elle est en France.